Hello everybody, welcome back to another Disney Pixar Cars video on my channel. And in today's video, I'll be taking a look at the Deluxe Dinoco Showgirl number 1. So she came out a long time ago in Cars, a part of the Dinoco Daydream series. And uh, she was seen in Cars 1, mm, I believe in Cars 3 as well for a brief moment in the background, not too sure. She was also seen in Blind McQueen's Daydream about um, being a new sponsor or new or having a new team, which is Dinoco. And you got to see them also at the end of the movie as well. Really cool. This is a deluxe die cast. Uh, I could probably get why because of the big hat or furry stuff up here. But, um... Yeah, I got I got a whole bunch of Dynaco diecasts I would want to review. So, um yeah, really cool. I have the um this is one of the ones I got a long time ago, like I said earlier. And enough of that chit chat, let's get straight into the video. So the Dynaco Showgirl is a nice light blue color on her body of the car and her hat is a nice uh silver uh, area down here with the feathers up there. She has a nice little smile right there, happy, smiling, with her eyes looking to the right side. Wait. Yeah, the right side of her, I believe. And I have a nice little blue color. Dinoco blue, blue eyes, blue car, blue feathers, everything blue. Her tires are also black with a blue inside there. All four of them are. She's like a simple um, car uh, type. Really simple, like one of the ones you see in the background of all the movies. Really cool. The main attraction here is the giant feather on top. So, it's kind of like a little crown here. The crown is like a nice silver color. has some nice little textures to it. And it has a little Dynaco logo on it. It's a nice egg that says Dynaco and has a giant um, dinosaur right there in a the nice blue color. Her feathers... Um, there are lots of feathers, and they're all clumped up together, and have, like, a big little hat in the movie. She's, she is a showgirl, so she kind of, like, mm, kind of moves the feathers a little bit. Feathers have a nice, hard texture to it. Really cool. Um, it has a nice curve from here to the top, and on the back of it, it's just a whole bunch of the more same-feeling texture. It's really cool. Don't really know how many feathers are on there. They're all clumped together, so I can't exactly tell how many feathers there are. But, uh, yeah, she was made by Mattel and was also made in China as well there. Really cool. Probably one of my favorite Dynaco Deluxes. I do have a couple more Dynaco diecasts I'd probably review in the future. Um, if the comments are allowed on this video, you guys can ask me or tell me, should I review tomorrow the Dynaco Mia and Tia scene in the Daydream series as well? Or, yeah, should I review these two? Uh, you guys can just tell me in the comments below and I will do so. If, if you guys say yes, I'll do it. If no, I won't make a video. That's totally fine with me. That's going to be it for today's video. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, leave a like on this video, and turn on the post notifications so you guys don't miss out on any of my videos. Hope to see you guys next time, and yeah, bye!